I'm caught up on Euphoria. Amazing show. I haven't seen the third episode. Don't spoil it. I haven't seen the third one yet either. All right, good. But how many seasons are there? Three? Two. It's, it's, they, they, they don't the the two second right season is coming out right now. There's like a three year gap between mm-hmm. it. And I'm yeah, very, very, very proud to announce I had sex with one of the girls from Euphoria. Fire. Like one of the main girls? Not really. The fucking She's well, like, I don't know. second she, season, they introduce a girl. She may be in the whole season. We don't really know. How far yeah. her character is gonna go? It's uh, Chloe Cherry is her real name. Fire! It's not like we had sex like because we we're into each other. We had sex because my girl lined up a threesome with her for Fire. OnlyFans. But is, is this like plug uh, talk? Uh, yeah, yeah. Is this plug talk? Uh, no, content? it's on her OnlyFans somehow. Like if you, if you follow Lena on OnlyFans and you DM her about Chloe, the Chloe Cherry scene, they'll send it to you. But that's honestly, how that works. I'm enjoying this show so much more. That you thought? Just knowing that my penis was inside one of the characters on the show. Have you ever had this experience before? Because I, I, I was thinking about it. Like, I don't think I've ever had like a TV show that I was watching and I fucked someone on the show. Yeah, I don't. I, but so. it makes me feel so much more involved in the show. It makes you feel like you. Or we're on the show. I knocked some TV mm. bitches before, but not like some shit I was watching. Like that's like when we had that threesome, it was. Within the confines of the show, like it actually happened, like I was actually on the show when that particular thing happened. That Fire. was just you like that was something that happened back in the day before this part in the show. No, because she's like a fucking crackhead heroin addict on the show. Oh, you mean you fucked her back in the day, not recently? No, probably like four years ago or something. Was she a junkie? Nigga, that's did a long time ago. Okay, her character on Euphoria. I know, is a junkie. <laughs> I don't know that she's a junkie in real. I have no idea, honestly. <laughs> Uh, but let's I, just assume she's not. Well, I've seen her at Riley Reed's wedding too, mm. and I didn't even know. So that you she fucked was gonna... her four years ago, and you didn't know she was an actor. You didn't know she was. Uh, well, you probably didn't even know about your four year four years ago. Facts. I hey, heard, it was about four years ago. I heard well, he just said it was a three year gap. I, it was, but it was either it? way, I heard. Wow. I heard that the fucking director of the show or the creator of the show or some shit that he saw her on like a porn site or in a, on Instagram or some shit, and he like kept her. In the back of his mind for like years and years and years before they started shooting the second season, and then he reached out to her because he felt like she had the perfect look for the show. Is Drake wow. still attached to that show? Yeah, he's like executive producer or some shit. That show, whatever that means. Nigga, whoever films that shit, I've never seen a show like that. That's bro. one of my favorite shows I ever watched in my really? whole life. Bro. Are it's you joking? It's, it's, it's Euphoria's up there. I've bro. never heard you say that about any show. You have oh, to get over the weirdness of the crazy. fact that it's a bunch of fucking. You know, grown people playing teenagers. High kids, yeah. So mm. you're looking at these girls, and they got big ass adult sized tits, but oh, they're supposed wow. to be 17 in the show, but they're like 30 in real life. So <laughs> why why couldn't they? Oh, yeah, never mind. I mean, but they've been doing. <laughs> you answer the question yeah. in your head. Why couldn't they have 17 yeah. year olds do it? Because they've been yeah. they've yeah. been doing shit like that like I had to through all the shows that. and shit. Right. Like having older people play younger people. Oh, Saved by the Bell. Say by the bell. How old I were used they? to be watching that, and this motherfucker, fucking Zach Morris, is Screech. like twenty nine or some shit. Playing the high school, big as hell, perfect quaff of blonde hair. You're looking at Kelly Kapowski; she's fly as fuck. And Lisa I'm, Turtle, and I'm like thirteen, thinking like this is like who I'm competing with because they're in they're in fucking high school on the show, and you're just thinking I look like shit. Mario Lopez is not aged at all. He's wearing pants with 18 buttons up the front. <laughs> pants with 18. He had drip. The more the more buttons, like, it adds on to the, the drip. AC Slater was like fucking Gunna before Gunna was Gunna. Because <laughs> he was just, just coming through with jerry curls and high-waisted fucking Jordash pants and R. shit. R.I.P. to, uh, what's Big the nigga name? Big penis is back. What's the nigga name from Say Body or Die? Screech. Screech, yeah. R.I.P. Rest yeah. in peace. Samuel Powers. You think Screech was knocking hoes? Like, Dustin like, Diamond. For sure. Like after that he show? He was a porn star, wasn't he? Yeah, he was, huh? He did some porn scenes. He did, he did some, some weird, he did some weird uh, like VH1 show or something. Well, I heard that. he did a Dirty Sanchez where he smeared poop under his on his top lip. I should probably Google that just to check out the story. Why did he do this? To celebrate Latinx culture. Why can't you just give me a real answer? Dirty Sanchez. Who was that a real guy? Who Sanchez? Like Sanchez? Well, Dirty Sanchez. Well, <laughs> <laughs> have you ever done that? <laughs> no. Fuck Why me. would you ask? Why AD? would you want to? How? What are, what are the mechanics of a Dirty Sanchez? It's isn't it like you? Oh, 
you fuck a girl in the ass from behind, and then oh, you pull you out, have, you, have you some flip shit her on over, and then you draw a mustache on her with poop on your dick, right? No. Isn't that like what that's supposed to be? I thought you smeared like I, yeah. I thought you, I thought you you put the poop lip, on huh? your finger and then you yeah. do do a fake mustache. Well, that's lazy. I would rather transfer it with my wiener. Transfer it. You want a chili dog to her face? Yeah, you're trying to chill. I'm just trying. Josh, can you Google Dirty Sanchez and give me some sort of clarity? Don't, on please this? don't put it on the screen. We're okay, gonna get. Don't show we're gonna Justin get the Diamond's <laughs> dick. Rest in peace. <laughs> He was them. already Googling it. Look Push at that. Put their finger in their partner's ass and wipes poop and they transfer onto their finger. <laughs> uh, Dirty Sanchez is an act where someone puts their finger into their partner's ass and wipes any poop that may transfer onto their finger. Why did Cosmopolitan.com write an article about this? Why is there an article about it in Google's arts and culture section? It's a fecal mustache. Wow. It does not matter how you do it. You better be careful on Urban Dictionary. It's I'm pretty sure they got naked ads on here. But Dick likes to give a Dirty Sanchez. Does Urban Dictionary have porno ads? Why would they? Oh, I guess it's not on the screen. It's anyway. Urban Dictionary, not like... Oh. Unless that cat with a bow is porn to you. <laughs> yeah. A lot of, like, <laughs> low-quality sites end up yeah. running porn ads because it's just, like, the only thing that they can get any get, money for running. Get money from? Damn. So, yeah. No, Rest so, in peace. No on the Dirty Sanchez. Rest in peace, Dustin Dust Diamond. Rest in peace to them. And also... I have a problem because my girl has a big fucking crush on one of the dudes from Euphoria. The fuck fans? Oh, the, the white guy? Yep. Wait, which one? Angus Cloud. So what you going to do like if if y'all meet him together? Stop him. The <laughs> white guy, the white guy, right? Yes. The, with the freckles? Yes. That it looks nigga, like Rory. That nigga um that nigga was at like this house party that the that the homie threw like a couple like 2 years ago. Really? Yeah, and I remember everybody was like, "Oh my god, the guy from Euphoria is here." Cuz he was that, like, "Fuck that's him." That's what I yeah, I haven't I'm like, like gone out of my way to like watch any content with him or anything, but that's what I'm kind of cuz he was in fucking North Hollywood too, right? Or was it what mid 90s? He uh, was in one of the mid, mid 90s. I think he was in one of the movies. So he's like a skater, fucking stoner dude or whatever. But I'm I'm wondering like is that his personality in real life? Cuz like He's such a good actor that it makes me feel like he's a fucking local drug dealer. Mid 90s is fire. I think he was in that. But yeah, my girl trying to fuck him, so that's kind of weird. What? For me. Yo, <laughs> are you serious? What's no. wrong with you? But she commented a fucking hard would you eyes. Be, would you be objective? Okay, okay, now she's oh, tripping. No, she's yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Now you might, have, you might have to go home and smack Should Lena up now. now. Lena, you tripping, Lena. <laughs> you might have to go home and smack Lena up now. See, she thinks he's like so famous that she can just do this and it's all no, jokes. No. Okay. Well, thank She's you. She's guys are twenty two. Yeah, you, you guys, guys are gay. You guys are famous. What thank the you. fuck? That's what I'm saying. But he's oh, way no. more famous than us, bro. He got yeah. like twenty million followers or some shit. Really? All them Zendaya Daya got fucking one hundred and forty million or some shit. What? I didn't know. She See, if I was you, I wouldn't even watch you for so you. So how no many? More. You, you, you ain't watching stop? this shit. <laughs> You watch it on your own time. Okay. Well, if you got if, if you were listening to Ralphie the Plug more, then you wouldn't you wouldn't be going for this shit. What do you think Ralphie the Plug would do? Slap his <laughs> 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 Fuck all that Tory Lane shit. We still smacking hoes. Okay, but do you does your girl have a celebrity crush? She, she did. She better not tell she me. She better not be talking about it. If not, she can, she have, not be he can, he can have her. She better not be throwing no hard eyes on the ground. Fuck no. That's out. And, Come and, on, and, Lena. And all these people are commenting on her fucking hard eyes coming, being like, oh, like, how are you going to do this to Adam? See? Or, uh, Damn. Adam down bad right And now. I tried to give her shit about it, but then she's like, okay, uh, you fucked like 30 bitches this year with me. Shut the fuck up. I'm like, wow. Mm -hmm. Still, it doesn't matter. I, mean, I kind of felt that. Damn. Mm. She's like, I'm just do leaving you, a comment. Do you have a celebrity crush? Nah. Do you have some? All the celebrity bitches. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know any celebrities besides, like, the only people I know are, like, people in rap and then, like, Instagram chicks and porn stars. They don't really feel like real celebrities to me, like someone I could Mulatto, never Mulatto, that's my celebrity crush. And because she got a big ass, uh, she got a big ass, uh, uh, what's that shit called? Slot machine L chain. Lotto down. Oh, it's just Lotto? Her, that's my crush. Mulatto was racist, apparently. Why is that racist? Because uh, it's like a so Indian. No, is it? it's a it's Not a word they used to describe a black and a white person, but then uh, they don't uh, like it anymore. What is she half and half or something? I think so. Yeah, I grew she up saying that shit. Fuck. That was just normal. That's my. Did you crush. grow up saying mulatto? No, no, I've never heard anybody say that ever. Where the fuck does that word come from? I don't know. Brown town. <laughs> <laughs> Origins. You know why I got a crush on her? Because she got a big ass, uh, like, big slot ass. machine. Yeah, she got a big <laughs> ass. But she also has a big ass slot machine chain. And I was just like, wow. Did you fuck with a girl whose chain was just straight shitting on your yeah, chain? Yeah, li literally like nine times the size of this. She would thing. have to upgrade my boy phone. 
Give me my phone. That'd there's be a, hard. There's a thing I wanted to read, but for some reason it was not printed out on here. Yeah, dude, that's that's either her or who else? Queen Latifah. Queen Latifah? That's yours? Stop lying. <laughs> he always trying to say some funny shit. <laughs> you say Oprah. Sometimes, sometimes. Nigga, who wouldn't take Oprah? You tripping? Yeah, sometimes the dyke vibes is what you need. You think you'd enjoy it? Oprah. Nigga, I'll beat, how many waters you gonna drink? I will beat them doonies down. <laughs> We're gonna charge you for those. <laughs> What's wrong with drinking? I didn't, you didn't even buy this one. You're just ripping through one, <laughs> nigga. popping open another. You I already would, drank one too. Yeah. You guys just don't drink water all day, and then you come here and just pound it. Bro, we just trying to be uh, healthy to be and hydrated. Healthy, man. We can't even be hydrated without the white man trying to put it down. <laughs> Hashtag water boys. You still banging that? Yo, shout out to Chris Travis, man. What's going on with water boys, bro? 